All right, hey everybody, I'm Lance Allen from LanceAllenStudio.com, and a friend just showed me this new song, Home. I'm going to show it to you. So you're going to make a C chord in your right hand. We've got a folky finger picking thing in the right hand, so pay attention to the right hand a little. Uh, what I'm doing here. I'm going to go thumb on the fifth string, then I'm going to hit a combination of four and two with my thumb and middle finger, and then thumb on the fifth string again, and then first finger third string, and then thumb on the fifth, fourth string. I'm sorry. So that's going to be happening throughout the song, and I would practice it slowly like this. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. And then you can double the speed. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And when we speed it up a lot, you're going to count half time. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right, the chord that's going to happen next is an F2, or we could call it a C suspended four, but in this case, it is an F2. You're basically putting your little finger down there on the third fret of the fourth string, and you're going to do the same right hand pattern for this particular chord. And you're doing that pattern twice for each chord. So I got C and F, C, F. Okay. So what I got here is uh, the verse is going to go from C to F. C to F two times. Uh, it looks like about like four times before it gets to A minor. When you do the A minor, it's the same right hand. And then it goes to F and C and F. And then we're going to get the walk down. The walk down, I do it like this. doing there is I walk down my notes that my thumb is hitting is the C note, 3rd fret, 2nd fret, open, 3rd fret. And I'm kind of keeping the C chord, most of the information on the C chord. What I'm going to do here is thumb, thumb first, string 5, 4, 3, and then I move my middle finger to the B note, 2nd fret, and I do the same fingering there, 5, 4, 3, and then I move down to the, I move my middle finger back down to what would have been part of the C chord, and I have my A note in the thumb. Then my third finger goes to the G. So it's a one and a two and a three and a four and a, and then it's going to go to A minor. Okay, so it's it's kind of a quick little one, two, and a three, four, one, one, two, three, four, one. Okay, and then it goes to F. This is the way I do it. I do a sh little F chord here, and I do the same thing one and uh, in the right hand string four, three, two. The middle finger goes to the E note one and uh, now lift it up, and I do this one twice. So it'll sound like this, and it's back to the C chord. And I'm just going to play C. F and then I'll do the C walk down and the F so you can see it and I'll do it slowly. Three, four, and one. Here's my walk down. verse is going to be sort of strummed through. You can find on my website a uh, chord chart to this. And that website is lanceallenstudio.com, but I'm going to provide a link right below there for you to get to that. And then the interlude is where they're doing the O's. Of course, the chord chart will be listed in there. The strum pattern for all that is going to be a down, down, up, down, the, kind of like the... That sort of rhythm. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and so on. Okay. So, 
If you like that lesson and want to know more about how to get signed up for Skype guitar lessons, uh, shoot me an email or visit my website, lanceallenstudio.com. And thanks for watching.